Happy Saturday, sports fans. I'm Chad Roderick, and let's jump right into it with CMU football hosting Black Hills State. CMU are ready for this one, coming off two straight wins over San Diego and South Dakota Mines on the road. Now the Mavs are going to strike first. They struck first, and Black Hills State looks for the long field goal, and it's right down the middle. CMU still leads 7-3 to three in the first quarter. Now it wouldn't stay that way for long as BHSU's quarterback Tanner Clarkson chucks a deep ball to the corner of the end zone, and it's caught by number three, Jamin Wirtz. And the, and the Yellow Jackets take the 10-7 lead in the first. They're pumped up. CMU ball, Herberg, he finds Hollingsworth and he makes his way down the sideline. Are they gonna catch him? And they're gonna, cause he's gonna get pushed out at the one. And the Mavs can't get it in on the one yard, yard line. They're stopped on fourth down. Not a great look for the Mavs on the E, should be an easy touchdown. Yellow Jackets ball, Clarkson in his own end zone, deep ball, and it's picked off by Jason Thome. The Mavs would score after this play. And now it's the Yellow Jackets turn. Clarkson finds, he's looking. Now he finds Chukuwara. How about that for a name? BHSU leads 16 to 14 on the Chukuwara touchdown at the half. In the fourth, BHSU lead 19 to 14. This time, Leslie Richardson finds Trevin Edwards in the Mavs lead 20 to 19 in the fourth, but can they hold on here in this one? Yellow Jackets look for a field goal and it's good. They lead 22 to 20. CMU here drive down the field and it sets up a field goal. It's good, 23 to 22. Well, there's still 38 seconds left in this ball game. BHU with one second left. The kick is up and it's good. Black Hills State with the 50-yard field goal to upset Colorado Mesa, 25-23 on the last second field goal. And it's a tough pill to swallow for the Mavericks in a game they were so close to winning, but they've got to keep moving forward and prepare for next week's rivalry matchup on the road against the Mountaineers of Western Colorado and Gunnison.